What's up all? Just a quick uh, first look video at this Bosch uh, laser. It's the, the one I have is the GPL 100-50G. And I think the difference is the 30G doesn't have these side lasers. It just has the front and the bottom. Um, it's a really compact little unit. It's easy. All there is is an off and on. There is a magnetic mount there. Right, and then you can turn this. Let me actually turn. I got my shop lights almost are bright as heck. Let me turn them off. Um, the hose is in the way there. Alright, so right now it's, if you see over there, it's flashing. If it, it flashes if it can't auto level from where it's at. So let's, let's put this. The magnet's pretty strong. I'll give it that. There we go. Alright, so there is the dot there. There's the other one. Now there is one that goes straight down if you're on a tripod. And if you can see all the way over, well, I'm in the way. Uh, if you can see that green dot right, uh, right there, it's all the way on the other side of the basement. It's probably like 25 feet away. Anyway, um, I would probably use this with a, a tripod, which I don't have since I got this through the Siege program, so I'm messing around with a little bit. Um, definitely would help if I was doing, you know, laying out cabinets um, or any kind of general uh, carpentry stuff, um, or just you want know, to use it for layout, shooting marks. It's pretty simple. It's powered just off of um, some AA batteries, two AA's that it came with. It came with some off brands. So right here is the cover. It's pretty much all the moving parts there are. The so, unit seems well built. Bosch stuff normally is. It's right there. As you, can, I don't know if you can tell. It has. I'm trying to see if I can show you all the. Yeah, it's not going to work now. But anyway, there's. It usually shoots uh, five sides. There's one, two, four sides. So you have a side one there. You have one that shoots straight up. You have one that shoots over there, over there, over there. I don't know why I'm not seeing the one on the ground. I guess there's not. Oh, that's why. So you have to move it off the base for the bottom one to shoot down. Let's see if we can do it. And it does have the auto level feature. There's one, two, three, and four. Let's see if I can get it to flash. So if you if it if it can't auto level, there it goes. See how it flashes? That that's to tell you that it can't auto level, and you can tell because I have it like that. So I'll just put it back on, and it levels. So it has basically like a job. Um, I don't know what they call, it, but see how it'll even when I have, so that's it stopped, but it, it'll the laser is is in uh, it, it's on a movable. I don't know if you can see it in there. There you go. It moves inside there, and that's how it ends up auto leveling. Pretty cool little compact device. I like it. I don't have a job right now to use it, so I wish I could show you like a better, you know, actual use of it. But it's a simple. It's simple. You know, it it spins on it on its uh, mount included mount. It's a, I believe quarter inch tripod mount on the bottom. It has the the magnets on it. So if you're just going if you're going somewhere. You, know, you can stick it on and then you can shoot that wherever you want. Pretty, it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. It's pretty bright. Like I said, I turned my, my shop lights off because they're it's like bright as day <laughs> when they're on there. And obviously, it's not you can't auto level there because of how I have it. You can auto level there. Not too much to show you. This is basically it, on off, simple magnets. It's got your five different points of reference, left, right, top, bottom, straight ahead. Uh, it comes with comes in this little case. Let's see if I remember how it went in there. I don't remember how it was in there. 
Ah, oh, there we go. Like that. There. Oops, sorry. Just fits right in there. One class. It's it's. You know, there's my hand. So it's a small box. Storage is easy because it's so little. Case is normal plastic that you get on all your all your tools. Um, this is kind of a got like a soft. I guess it might be rubber all around the outside. So the body of it's that is plastic, but it's like a softer rubber, so it's impact resistant, I would think, to a point. There you go. That's it. Uh, if you wanted to see it in person, this helps you. Sorry, I don't have an actual job to have something laid out so I could show you how you'd use the laser. I just don't have um, stuff I'm working on now is furniture, so you don't really need a you don't need a laser to make panels. And I hope that uh, hope that helped you out. Sorry I couldn't give you too much info because it's a pretty simple little tool. I would recommend it, and I got it through the Home Depot Seeds program, so I didn't purchase this. It was sent to me to review, and uh, that's it. Have a good one.